Guys, I think I might have chose to film a haul on the hottest day of the year. I'm actually sweating. Welcome back to my channel. So we do have a haul today, but I need to make it quick because I literally need to get out of this room. But I bought some stuff recently, so we can finally do another what I've bought recently haul. Not a massive one, and also some of it was very, very cheap. I'm gonna literally get straight into it. I'll link everything down below. I need to make this as short a video as possible because I've literally been in this room five minutes and I'm dying. So we've got a few different shops, but not loads, like a lot of the shops are just one thing, apart from a couple. But I'm gonna start with my favorite, which is Jaded London, but I got this particular thing on Urban. So I'm sure everyone knows by now how much I love bloomers. And these are my new personalities. How cute are they? Like, seriously, haters I don't want to know. I've had enough of the haters. TikTok went, I say TikTok went crazy, that's such an exaggeration. About four girls went crazy over these bloomers and I don't know what's wrong in their head. Like, fair enough if you don't like bloomers, but oh my God, why are you on your little phone? It's embarrassing. Anyway, moving on. So I just kind of wanted an excuse to buy these, so I've decided I'm going to wear them to Taylor Swift. And I can't wait, that's in like two weeks I think. So I can wear them soon, they're like a bit much to just wear normally. But I'll try them on and I'll show you what they look like. I've got black underwear on so ignore that if that's visible. But this is what they look like, they're literally perfect. So these are in a size 4. I could have got a 6 but like there's not really any need but I think you'll be fine like... My normal size is a four or I could have sized up if that helps with sizing, but I've stuck with my normal size. They are like very, very low waisted. I don't know if you sized up, if that would make a difference or not, or it would just make them bigger and then they'll just kind of fall down. I don't know. I can't tell, but they are very low waisted either way. They're also very expensive. They're like £40, so maybe check Vinted. But I almost got the like cream version of these when I got my white pair of like just urban ones. So when I saw this pink colour of these, I was like, I just have to, they're so perfect for me. This might end up being a little sneak peek into what my Taylor Swift outfit's going to be, because I might change my mind, but at the moment, I think I'm going to wear the top with these bloomers and cowboy boots and ribbon, that kind of vibe. But next, we've got ASOS, although the brand of this top is Monkey, and it's this brown, it's a backless top, this one's really hard to show you without trying it on, so I'm just gonna try it on. Once again, realizing how dark this room is. It's actually the sunniest day today. It's not gloomy at all, but I still look like I'm in the dark. Anyway, this is the top. It like ties at the back in two bows, and then it's a halter neck, but then the front's just a high neck, and then I like this little kind of frilly bit here. I just think pink and brown is quite nice as a color combo, especially for Taylor. I'm like half debut, half lover. But yeah, I got this top in an extra small. I think it also came in like an orangey colour, I'm pretty sure. But I went for the brown. I just feel like this could also be a dressy top in autumn as well as wearing it in summer. But I think this might be my outfit. I don't know. I keep trying it on in the night and then like questioning it. So I don't know. But love monkey stuff. It's always such good quality. I'm now questioning if this came in like extra small sizing or like size 4 sizing. But either way, it would have either been a size 4 or an extra small. Then the last bit of like just the odd bits before we go into the two main bits. I can't remember if I've put these shorts in a haul already. I don't think I have. So I got these shorts from Stradivarius. They're just like little loungewear shorts. I'm not hating on anyone that wants to wear these out. Like I'd happily wear these out, but they do look quite pajama ray. I also got told many times on tiktok even though i was wearing them in my own house it makes me want to wear them out as an outfit just to annoy people so this is them on they're just like comfy little shorts they're like boxer um short style i did size up in these to a size small because they're meant to be very tight like booty shorts and i sized up just they were like a tiny bit baggier so they were a bit more wearable if i did want to wear them out but i'm obsessed with them i think they're the cutest i love the little print that they've got i just realized this has been in the shot that is so annoying that is gonna bug me. It's back. Oh, go away. Okay, next, moving on to the ASOS sample cell, which I didn't know was going on, um, but I did end up getting four bits from it. Most of the stuff was sold out, but all of these things cost 
either £3.72 or £3.73 each because everything's up for a fiver but then you can negotiate with this little bot on there which is so fun and just see how low that they'll go so all of these things were like three pounds something each so starting with these trousers which are from Bashka, just like a beige high waist baggy trousers i got these for work because i wear the black ones to death all the time and i thought for three pound the beige ones i'll wear them to work all the time do you know what this top doesn't even look bad with them i just don't like their um like not being a gap like if it kind of was like that but then i don't wear high rise so that's probably my problem like i'd only wear these to work i'm gonna tuck this up so you can see a bit better but this is what they look like they literally you can see the label on the back they literally fit amazing i got a size four and they're not even that long like they're the tiniest tiniest bit long but with shoes on completely fine so i'm really surprised i thought i'd have to get them taken up and then I also got this just plain black top, which is also mainly for work. I'm not going to try this on because it's quite tight and I'm so hot. I just can't deal with that right now. But it's literally just a plain black um, crop top. But I did try this on earlier and it's the nicest fit. I didn't think it was going to be because I had to get this one in like tall so i because it's for work and it's a crop top i thought that would be fine because it just means it'll be a little bit longer so maybe it's just worked in my favor but i was a bit worried about the fit by from the tall section and being five foot three but it is a size four and it fits like super tight and it's just the perfect length for high rise trousers like this to wear to work so this is going to be my new little work outfit and next we've got a top which is the brand sixth june now I had to get this one in a size small and I'm not the biggest fan of the fit. I'll put it on now just so you can kind of see how it fits but it's one of those like open front ones where it's got like, like that says the brand name but that doesn't come undone. I'm not really sure if you need to wear something under it or not. Okay so you don't have to wear something under it although I would probably find like a little bralette to put under it I think if I was going to wear this out just because it doesn't feel very secure. I also don't like how it looks right now, I think, because I've got these like work trousers on. I'm being completely thrown off. I need to style it properly to see if I like it. But it's the sleeves I don't really like because they're like, a little bit big and like a bit too structured up here. But I think it's because it's a size small and I probably just needed the size down. But styled with the right thing, I think it is a cute little top. So I'm going to try style this and see if I want to keep it. And then lastly from the ASOS sample sale are some denim shorts from Pull and Bear, which I was so, so excited for. They've got like the stepped hem, I'll show you in a minute, like the stepped waistband, but they're just not the fit I wanted. Like I, I need my stuff to be baggy, like any shorts or jeans, it's got to be baggy and they're quite tight, but I'll show you what they look like. So firstly, they're high rise and secondly, they're tight. So I don't know what to do with these. I might not keep them, but at the same time, I could just keep them for like something to chuck on to go on a dog walk or something like that. So I don't know. But I had high hopes for these, but maybe I needed to size up like a few sizes because these are a size four and maybe I could have created like a different fit if I sized up, I'm not sure. But either way, I do love how the waistband looks where it's like a bit asymmetric and I really like the colour of denim as well so it is a shame and lastly on to Ego now I don't shop on Ego very often because obviously it's very known for not even it's dupes but like it's fakes like it's very well known for having very very close replicas of stuff so when I go on there for clothes I don't know if I'm accidentally buying a dupe or not but I did get two tops from there because they had a sell and there were tops on there for like four pounds and I did knowingly buy a replica of some sunglasses, but I did it on purpose because now I don't like wearing fakes and dupes. Like I'd rather have the real thing or not have it at all. But when it comes to sunglasses, I actually don't like wearing sunglasses at all. Like I just don't wear them unless it's for a picture. So when I saw the Miu Miu sunglasses on there, literally almost looking identical, I thought, they'll look really cool for a picture they're only 10 pounds so i did buy them which i'll show you in a minute but on the whole i don't like buying dupes and stuff so i don't know how to feel about it but they do look cool on pictures so so this first top i really really like it's just like a simple asymmetric top i've put some white bloomers on from urban by the way just to try these tops on um but i just needed a top like this really i don't have like you know when it's like just a simple top but 
just chuck it on for any occasion basically because it's a little bit dressed up so this is it on it's just simple but i love the whole like going off the shoulder situation and i love this little detail down hair so it's just got quite a bit going on and i just think it's like a cool top like just jeans and a nice top chuck this on but yeah the only thing i will say about this is it's a little bit big for me here so when i sit down i've realized that then it like drapes down so it's kind of like a standing up top but i do really like it when i'm stood up i also can't remember what ego sizing was for all of these but i got the tops in the smallest size they did which i think could have been a six and next we've got this top which is like a ruched khaki twist strap going on now i have actually since buying this i've seen a top from jaded come up which looks very similar so i'm a bit worried this is meant to be a jaded dupe but i didn't like it anyway so i'm not really gonna wear it but i'll try it on and show you what it looks like do you know what now i've tried it on again i'm not hating it as much as i thought i hated it like it's actually okay the problem i have with it is the front basically is way longer than the back and i think it's meant to like ruche up a bit but it's just not quite tight enough for that so it's kind of just like quite a long top and these shorts are low waisted so i don't know i mean it kind of looks cool hanging over the shorts i guess i don't know how to feel but i'm not hating it anymore i think this is quite cool like the contrast so we'll see and then lastly and really quickly because my camera's gonna die we've got the sunglasses so this is what they look like i got white because i've already got black and pink like normal sunglasses that's the situation so you can see what i mean but um i think they're cool i normally just wear sunglasses on my head anyway so you never even see the side but this is what they look like if you do want to wear them normally i think they're quite cool and they came in so many colors they had like black like brownie tortoisey shell i don't know if that's the right word and they had like a beige color as well so i'm not hating on them but they are quite a replica so that is everything i've got to show you in my haul i hope you enjoyed i will link everything down below i don't know what i'll be able to do with the asos sample cell stuff i might need to see if i can find the thing like on its actual website but don't forget to follow me over on instagram and tiktok i'm currently being bombarded by creepy old men on instagram so any female followers over there are extremely welcome thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video